Okay, today we are replacing the throttle body. It's by Mercedes-Benz C240 Formatic. This is a 2004, but I think that the same procedure applies for all the C-Class of those years, whether they're two or four wheel drive. <laughs> Stay tuned. Okay, the car is throwing the code is P0221 TPS, throttle position sensor, switch B, check range performance, whatever that means. It means that this TPS, this uh, sensor inside the throttle body uh, was bad. It was the performance wasn't right or the range wasn't right or whatever. I think it's just a potentiometer inside that tells the ECU what's the position of the throttle. Um, anyway, we have to change the throttle body. This is what this, this, is what this uh, uh, code means. Okay, so we are replacing the throttle body on a Mercedes C240. That's the new one. And uh, so first we remove this thing that holds this part in place. This is after we remove the uh, engine cover and that uh, other engine cover that also holds the air filter and uh, the throttle body is down there, it's held in place by four bolts and um, yeah and now I have to remove this elbow. Okay this is the elbow it just came out. It's just held in place by these two clips, this one and this one. This one will be visible but this one will be buried down there so you have to reach with your finger down there and push push on this tab but you will see the tab and this is visible you can just pry it with your screwdriver and then there is a hose connected here it is this hose here and so now we got to see the throttle body it is right there that's one of the bolts I got to remove another one is down there and those are the other two so that's the throttle body Another piece came out. Okay, this is the old throttle body that just came out. It sits like this. There is a hose that sticks in here, and then four bolts hold it, hold it, and then there is an electrical connector there in that socket. And that's all. It comes right out. You remove the four bolts, and you remove the, the hose, and it comes out. Now I'm gonna install the new one and see what happens. Okay, I just put the new one there and it went in really nicely. Again, we're gonna start from the from this uh, hose that is at the top. Um, right here. And then we put the bolts. The bolts are 245s um, Torx T45s and uh, yeah this is the hose I was talking about that's the first thing that should go in and then and then the bolts and the electrical connector down there. Okay the throttle body went in it's right there now I'm putting the elbow back Place. There is that hose there. Um, there is that hose that has to connect there, and then it just clips in. Okay, the elbow is there. Back in. Now I'm gonna put this other part that has the mass airflow sensor there. I didn't change it. It looks clean. I'm not gonna change it for now. I hope that I don't have to. But even if I have to, it's not. It's not too much work to get it out. So now this one's gonna go back. This kind of collar holds it in place. And then I'm taking the car for a spin. Okay, this is the last piece. It's this big uh, engine cover that is also the air filter housing. And you just put it there and you just connect these ducts here. One and two. They just pop out like this. Then you push it in and it has these clips, these metal clips. 
they thought from Toto's rather knobs and it has two more back there that needs so make sure that you push it back here until you hear it clicking. So now the car drives fine and the thing was very successful and um, some uh, Mercedes guy told me that he wanted to charge me hundred dollars to initialize the new throttle body it wasn't needed um, uh, the, the Mercedes dealer wanted a thousand dollars to change to buy a new uh, throttle body I used I bought an, a used one from a junkyard for sixty seven dollars um, the job was pretty easy um, even if everybody was telling me ah Jerry have you done this before no I haven't ah Jerry have you ever worked on Mercedes before no I haven't ah Jerry but do you think that if it if it if the guy asks you a thousand dollars do you think you can do it yourself by 65 67 well it turns out I can so no codes anymore I just checked it doesn't throw any code car drives great I'm really happy. Do it too.